What's up guys? This is Luke for LZ Fitness, bringing a brand new video. And in today's video, I'm going to show you the Bells of Steel Safety Squad Bar, the SS3. I'm going to see if it's right for your guys' home gym. Hope you guys enjoy. Oh, I swear, I feel like I aged 50 years by doing back squats. Oh, and I feel like I'm like 85 now. Dude, okay, Luke, I mean, Grandpa, I mean, <laughs> I mean, Luke, listen, man, I have something that I think will cure your back problems and your shoulder problems, and you'll be pain-free and back to your youthful self. You ready? Oh. Wow. She's beautiful. All right, guys, before we get into this review of the Bells of Steel Safety Squat Bar SS3, make sure you check out my recent video where I talk about the angled multi-grip bar bar from, barbell from Titan Fitness and see if it's right for your home gym. It'll be in the description and up here. I'm excited to review this product for you guys. I've always wanted a safety squat bar because the fact that hopefully the screen is up here because the legs need some work. And this piece of equipment is really something ideal for me that's going to help with my training, with my legs, and force me to squat more. So I'm excited to re review this for you guys and see if it's a recommendation you should try out for your guys' home gym. All right, we're in the garage. Excited to review this, guys. So right here we have the Bells of Steel SS3 Safety Squat Bar. So just getting a little bit of a look of this bar. Now... Kind of showing off the product, talking about first for you in the price is the unboxing, which I'm going to show you guys a video right now of the unboxing. It came well packaged, had styrofoam in it as well to keep that padding to make sure the bar is secure. It doesn't come out with any chips, any cracks. It's in good shape. Now, I, I already commend them for that. Packaging is important, especially for a bar, you know, not exactly, you know, the cheapest price. It's something you want to keep for a long time. It's something that I was very satisfied Bells of Steel did was their packaging. Now, if we talk about the brand in general, Bells of Steel, I'm going to plug you know, some information about their company here. I think they've been around for 2010, American made, free shipping as well on their products. And I love supporting you know, American companies. So they, make, they make these kind of products to help you know, show out to you guys, everyone out there that loves you know, their home gym looking for equipment this is a bar that i have been satisfied with i want to continue to break it down so that it see if it's you know something that you would want for your guys's home gym okay so let's first talk about the price because that's the most important the price is 350 dollars. now i'm not an expert but i really don't think that is a bad price for a specialty bar of this caliber okay it really <laughs> It's pretty solid. And the fact, too, like, like I talk about specialty bars. Specialty bars are meant to be a little bit more of, you know, you're not typical $150. You want this to be something that at that price, because you know it's going to be quality, and it's going to last you, and durability is important. Now, if we talk about the specs. Now, right here, I'm going to plug the specs, too. My lovely camera woman is going to show you guys a glimpse of the bar as well. If we talk about the length of this bar, it's 86.6 inches total in length if we talk about the weight the weight of this bar is 47.5 pounds and then if we look at here we have the zinc finish you know to help with you know no chipping and i i love the black finish i think it looks really slick really sleek and then if we if we look too at our pad design this is a single pad design to really if we get even i'm going to get underneath this for you guys it's pretty comfortable on my shoulders. And I think that's another reason why I like the fact of the safety squat bar with this is the fact it's comfortable. Yeah, you could get a power bar. You could get a pad over the power bar to put around the back of your traps. To be honest, that was always still uncomfortable for me. This thick padding to go around your shoulders makes it so much easier when you're squatting. I think that's really important. And also, we continue over here. They have rotating sleeves, you know, and they also fit two two-inch Olympic plates. And I have my spring collars, and 
I can grab one here for you guys real quick and just show you guys over here. The spring collar fits perfectly on the bar, which is important. Especially if you have the clamps too. The clamps fit well with it as well. But those are just a couple things to mention so far about the bar. And I'm very excited to be blessed with this. So something else to mention on their specs that relates, this is actually really important for you guys with getting this bar if you're interested, is the length of your rack. So your rack has to be at least 47 inches for it to be able to be rackable in your bar. So this is my Titan T3 series squat rack. And I mean, you could tell, you know, these, my J hooks move a little bit, which when I put it on my roller ones back there, they fit just fine. I think because they're more secure back there. I usually don't squat using these. This is just for the review, but it fits nicely back there on my roller T3 series J cups. Make sure you measure your squat rack for so because you don't want to get this and it doesn't fit and you're going to be upset. You spent all this money and you have to you know, return it. So keep that in mind. And something else to mention too is weight capacity holds up to 1500 pounds, which if you're squatting that much, you are jacked. You're jacked. And that, <laughs> holy cow, that's impressive. You're able to do that. But regardless, another thing I wanted to mention I really think is really cool is there's different handles that you can get. Now, the handles that are on the bar right now are the ones that I predominantly use when I squat because it's most comfortable for me. But they have these other handles right here. These are more of your, uh, these kind of handles right here are more for, I would say, just to kind of keep the balance when you're holding it on your back. They don't really do a whole lot. It just gives you a little bit of support when you're squatting. And they also gave me these other handle lengths. These are a lot longer. And these are better for, because when you're squatting, they're more outwards and protects your shoulders a little bit more because of the angle you're at when you're squatting. But it's nice to have those options if for some reason, like when you're squatting, whatever kind of lifts you're doing, you want to switch up the handles. That's a nice option to have as well. So the reason why in the first place, why would you even get a safety squat bar? Now, if you're a big home gym guy, garage gym guy, you probably know the answer to this, but if you're new to the channel or you're new to these kind of specialty bars, these are the reasons I've gathered and understood by having this. One of the main things I think is the fact that it takes away from your shoulders putting too much tension when you're doing you know, a barbell back squat, which I think I talked to my buddy about this this is not a natural movement, natural movement at all, especially 315 pounds your back. Right away, that's hitting your shoulders, causing tension in your shoulders. So when you're sitting here and you're right here, it's more of a natural movement and you're not sitting here like this, less tension on your shoulders, which is important because you want longevity in your shoulders because almost every lift you do impacts your shoulders, which is important. And the fact that I feel like too with how it's more kind of angled padded on your neck it's more quad focus because you're taking away less on your shoulders more predominantly on your posterior chain your quads which i feel like i can do more weight with the safety squat bar and i feel like my form is so much better and in the end that's why i actually like to squat more and actually i feel like there's some definition in my quads in the past three weeks i feel like something's coming in a lot no it's three weeks I'm not going to get giant quads in three weeks, but I, I notice a difference in how my legs feel when I'm using this bar because of less tension in my shoulders, more quad focused, and overall, this thing is just highly versatile piece of equipment to add to your leg day routine. All right, so I want to put this into action and show you guys. I did this with my Titan Fitness one where I'm just going to kind of do a couple of lifts that I've done with the safety squat bar. They advertise a lot more when you guys are going to bellsofsteel.com and you're looking up to say squat bar, they have a couple of YouTube videos of other exercises that they do as well to check out. But here are some exercises I've done with my Bells of Steel SS3 safety squat bar and see if you guys enjoy.
Thanks for watching, guys. Just did a couple lifts there just to show you in action. So if you're interested in buying the Bells of Steel SS3 safety squat bar, make sure you use my affiliate link, which will be in the description. If you're interested in buying, let me know in the comments what you guys think of the bar, what you think of a safety squat bar. If you think it's right for your home gym, I am really, really tired. <laughs> I'm out of breath. It's about 95 degrees in the garage well, outside today, so it's hot in here. But regardless, hope you guys enjoy the review, enjoy the video. I got a new review coming out in two weeks. But yeah, one thing I forgot to mention too, side note, you got to give them a hard time, Bells of Steel. This is Ls of Steel SS3 coming in hot. <laughs> Joking. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you guys in the next video. This is LMZ Fitness. This is Luke. See you guys later. like I aged about 50 years from doing back squats. Thank God I have this cane to keep me sane. Oh, not sane.